The word cricket came into the ears of ordinary people in the year in the 18th century. Cricket became popular among ordinary people, and in the mid 19th century, cricket was played worldwide, and at this time, many countries were preparing their cricket teams. The ICC International Cricket Council was responsible for conducting these matches. So basically, cricket is a game that is played using a ball and a bat between the two teams, the number of players in each group is 11, and 5 players are ready for substitution in each section. In this article, we will discuss the top 10 batsmen in the world. Sachin Tendulkar, this name stands first whenever there is a conversation regarding cricket, batting, sportsman spirit, and teamwork, Sachin Tendulkar is a very common name for every cricket fan. He is also known as Run Machine, Master Blaster, Little Champ, Batting Maestro, and most popularly by God of Cricket and so on. Sachin was born on April 24, 1973, in a middle-class family in Mumbai, India. He started his cricket journey at the age of 11 and made his first cricket debut in the year 1989 against Pakistan. Sachin is a right-handed batsman who is better known for his strategies, soft batting skills, and his ability to read the game. He also captained the international cricket team of India. Sachin Tendulkar was the only cricketer of his time who scored 15,050 runs in the ODI and 18,000 runs in test matches. He is better known for his record of receiving the most man of the match trophies in every series. Sachin Tendulkar was the top order batsman in his team. He made his OD debut against the Pakistan cricket team in 1989 on December 18th and played his last OD match against the Pakistan team in 2012 on March 18th. Sachin Tendulkar also played in domestic cricket tournaments like the Big Bash Cricket League in Australia and IPL, Indian Premier League in India and captained the Mumbai Indians for a few years. The full name of Brian Lara is Brian Charles Lara. He was born in the year 1969 and is one of the greatest cricket legends of all time. Brian Lara is famous for his smooth baiting skills on the cricket pitch. In 1994, he scored 502 runs and was not out against Durham at Edgbaston Cricket Pitch. In 2004, Brian Lara scored 400 continuous runs and was not out against England at Antigua. Brian Lara had maintained a world record in Test cricket for 18 years when he scored 28 runs in a single over in a Test match. Brian Lara was an all-rounder cricket player, he was a left-handed batsman and a right-arm leg break bowler. He plays for West Indies in international matches from 1992 to 2007. Brian Lara made his cricket debut in 1990, on December 6, against Pakistan. Moreover, Brian Lara played his last cricket test match against the Pakistan team. The OD shirt number of Brian Lara was 9. The Australian cricket legend Ricky Ponting is known for his batting skills and captaincy. Ricky Ponting played a crucial role as captain for the Australian cricket team, which was considered the golden era for the Australian cricket team between the year 2002 to 2011. Ricky Ponting was considered one of the best captains, with a success rate of Asad Dashamlav Ek Pratishan. Ricky Ponting is also considered one of the best batters of the modern cricket era. He scored the highest cricket runs in a test match in the past 50 years. Ricky Ponting is a right-handed batsman, he played all his international matches for his country Australia. Ricky Ponting made his cricket debut in international matches in 1995 on December 8 against Sri Lanka, and his OD debut was on February 15, 1995, against South Africa. Ponting's last test cricket match was played against the South African team on December 3, 2012. Ricky Ponting also played the IPL Indian Premier League cricket series in India, represented Mumbai Indians, and later became their batting coach. Sir Isaac Wiven Alexander Richards was better known by his nickname Wiv Richards. He was born in Est. Jones, Antigua, a part of the British Leeward Islands. Wiv Richards began his cricket journey by playing for the domestic cricket team in West Indies. Wim Richards started his international cricket career by playing for the international West Indies cricket team and played from 1974 to Uni Soi Kyangwe. He made his international test cricket debut on November 22, 1974, against India and his international OD debut in 1975, on June 7, against the Sri Lanka cricket team. In his first international debut test match, he scored well. All the spectators in the stadium were spellbound by his batting skills but the glory from his bat was no longer sustained. Later, he suffered from a disease named Tergium, and because of his eye surgery, 
he lost control over his reflexes though he could maintain his position as one of the world's best batsmen. Wim Richards made 25 centuries and scored 8,540 runs in 120 international test matches. Wim Richards played his last test match for West Indies against England in 1991 on August 8, and later he took retirement from the OD series in the same year 1991 on May 7. Virat Kohli is another shining star of the international cricket team, well known for his batting skills and fielding skills, and the favourite part of Virat Kohli, which his fans like him the most, is his aggression on the cricket pitch. Virat Kohli was born into a middle-class family in Delhi in India. He started taking professional training for cricket at the age of 8. Virat also mentioned in his interviews that he got full support from his family. Later he got selected for the international under-19 cricket men's team and played a key role in his team winning the international under-19 men cricket world cup. This win created a pathway for him to get a place in the international men's cricket team. Virat Kohli is a right-handed batsman. His international OD cricket debut was in 2008 on August 18, debuting in the international test cricket match in 2011 on June 20 against West Indies. Leading sports magazine like Forbes and ESPN has put Virat Kohli as one of the most influential people in the world. Virat Kohli is often known as King Kohli by his fans. Despite these, he is the winner of many national and international awards like the Arjuna Award in 2013, which is awarded to the best athlete in India. In the year 2017 he won the Padma Shri Award under the sports category and the highest sports award in India, is Rajiv Gandhi Khel Ratna Award is also awarded to Virat Kohli. He was awarded to the best cricketer of the decade from 2011 to 2020. For the year 2018, he was awarded the Sir Garfield Sobers Trophy for the best cricketer of the year. Kumar Chokshanada Sangakara, often known as Kumar Sangakara on a cricket pitch. He was born in 1977 on October 27 in a middle class family in Matale near the city of Kandy in Sri Lanka. He started his cricket career with the advice and encouragement of his college principal, and he started playing many domestic cricket matches. In 2000 on July 5, Kumar Sangakara debuted in OD Cricket International matches and played against Pakistan's international cricket team. In 2000 on July 20, Kumar Sangakara debuted in Test Cricket International matches, played against the South African international cricket team, and scored a great score against them. Kumar Sangakara is a left-handed batsman, right arm of break bowler, and wicketkeeper. Nowadays, he is the coach of Rajasthan Royal, and he also played the IPL Indian Premier League for Rajasthan Royal. Kumar Sangakara has made many international cricket records in all formats of matches. He scored 28,015 runs in his 15-year international cricket career. Kumar Sangakara scored 11,780 in international cricket at the number 3 position by defeating Rahul Dravid and Ricky Ponting. Sir Donald Bradman, often known as Don Bradman on the cricket pitch, is known as the Don among his fans. Don Bradman is considered the best batsman of all time in international cricket, he is an Australian batsman. Don Bradman is popular among fans because of his outstanding performance in international test cricket matches. His batting average in test cricket is Ninyanwe Dashamlav North Team. Don Bradman is a right-handed batsman who played for the Australian international cricket team from 1928 to 1948. Don Bradman debuted in an international test cricket match in 1928 on November 30. Don Bradman is also considered the most attacking batsman of all time, he is known for his aggression on the cricket pitch. Don Bradman is considered the only batsman in cricket history with an abating strike rate of 99.96 in international test cricket match because, nowadays, almost all batsmen plays with a very low strike rate. Walter Reginald Hammond is often known as Wally Hammond among his cricket fans. Wally Hammond was a middle-ordered batsman, most often, he came in the fourth position. He was considered one of the greatest batters of his era from 1922-1930 because of his excellent batting skills and ability to understand the game. Wally was later made the captain of his team, England. Moreover, Wally Hammond was a brilliant slip fielder and an extremely good fast-medium pace bowler. Wally Hammond debuted in international test cricket for England in 1927 on December 24 and played against the international test cricket team of South Africa. Wally Hammond played his last international test cricket match against the international cricket test cricket team of New Zealand. 
Wally Hammond in his first class international cricket career Wally scored almost 168 centuries. England's cricket team under the captaincy of Wally Hammond played 20 international test cricket matches and won 4 matches and 13 matches were declared a draw. In his international test career, Wally scored 7249 runs and grabbed almost 84 wickets, which indicates that he is the best batsman or all-rounder of his era. Sir John Berry Hobbs, popularly known as Jack Hobbs among his fans, was born in 1882 on December 16th, Cambridge, England. His friends say that he was fascinated by cricket and determined to play cricket at the international level, but at his early stage Sir John Hobbs was not a good player, but in 1901 he improved his game and came into the eyes of some local cricket teams which prepared a path for Jack Hobbs to enter into the international test cricket matches and his journey to enter into the international cricket team Tom Hayward an international test batsman helped him. Sir Jack Hobbs in 1908 debuted in an international test cricket match against the Australian international test cricket team. He played a key role in batting format for his team and helped to score a brilliant score against the Australian team. The match was played on the pitch of Melbourne Cricket Ground. Sir Jack Hobbs was popular among his fans because of his excellent strike rate and he scored 5411 runs in 61 matches. Sir Jack Hobbs was acknowledged as the all-time great in cricket because of batting records like his 15 international test centuries. In his international test cricket career, Sir Jack Hobbs scored 5410 runs. Sunil Gavaskar, another cricket legend from India, was born in 1949 on July 10th in Bombay. Gavaskar was born and raised in a Marathi family and since his childhood he was determined to play cricket and represent his nation. Sunil Gavaskar was highly acknowledged among his cricket fans because of his batting skills particularly against the fast bowler. Most of the records were made against the West Indies fast bowlers. They were considered the fastest of all at that time. Sunil Gavaskar was an opening batsman who played with a very high batting strike rate. He debuted in international test matches in 1971 on March 6th and played against the West Indies international cricket team. His last international test cricket match played in 1987 on March 13th against the international test cricket team of Pakistan.